Floating at zero gravity in an aeroplane, Major Tim Peake is training to become the first British astronaut in space for more than 20 years, expected to visit the International Space Station in 2015. Before that, there's a lot to do, as Peake explains to Euronews correspondent Ali May. We do a lot of training in weightlessness, for example, on parabolic flights. We learn about EVA, which is extravehicular activity, how to do spacewalking. We learn about robotics. I've trained as a Eurocom, which is the communicator with the space station so that we actually work with the crew on board and we help them in their daily jobs. So we kept very busy whilst we we're waiting for our mission assignments. The British government says peak selection as one of six astronauts picked from 8,000 hopefuls is a landmark moment for the UK. We've got a very successful space industry that's growing at about 8% a year. We're big in telecoms, for example. We make many of the world's commercial telecommunications satellites. But it's an event like this, sending an astronaut up into space and to, up to the space station, that really brings home to people that we're serious. And it signals that Britain is a space-faring nation and proud of it. A former Apache helicopter pilot with the British Army, Peake is set to live and work on the International Space Station for six months when his mission begins.